National Conservation Campaign. Community awareness and behavior is the first message to the world of its commitment to sustainable practices in various sectors and its sustainable achievement. Campaign Goal Raising the level of awareness and behavior of the Emirati community and conservation. Targeted categories Students, families, employees, tourists and workers. Consumption saving methods Energy and water. Methods to reduce electricity usage in electrical devices. Energy saver devices. Energy saving devices should be used and purchased to conserve electricity and rationalize energy consumption or replace all devices with modern energy saving devices. For example, it is recommended to replace the old electrical oven, dishwasher or dryer with new devices, taking care to search for devices that contain a standard energy star. As this sign is often found on modern devices which show how much energy each device is consuming. Turn off the computer when not in use. Computers are one of the devices that consume a large amount of electrical energy in homes, offices and companies. So it is important to turn off the screen during the night or when the device is not in use instead of keeping it on the power saver mode. Noting that turning off the screen does not negatively affect the device life. Separation of electronics. Leaving the mobile phone charger unused will cause it to remain connected to the electricity and absorb a certain amount of electrical energy, which causes electricity waste and increases the cost of the bill. Avoid operating electrical appliances such as washing machines, dishwashers, if they are not completely full. Avoid leaving electrical appliances running in vain, such as leaving the refrigerator door open while doing some other things. Try to rely on the solar heater as much as possible instead of the electrical heater. Clean the electromagnetic coil in the back of the refrigerator at least once a year as a dirty coil reduces the efficiency of the refrigerator and thus increasing its energy consumption. Methods to reduce electricity consumption in lighting. Choose energy saving lamps. It is possible to conserve electricity and reduce its consumption by replacing the incandescent lamps in the house with LED lamps, as it is most efficient option to conserve energy as it consumes 75% less than the incandescent lamps and it lasts 25 times more than the incandescent bulbs. Installing light bulbs linked to motion detectors for outdoor lighting, which automatically turn off when the place is clear of any movement of people. The lamps should be chosen whose wattage corresponds to the place they are located and the functional purpose they serve. Take advantage of sunlight as much as possible. Clean lamps regularly and turn off lamps in unused rooms. Paint the walls in light reflecting colors. Installing lighting, control switches at the entrances and exit of rooms as this helps to facilitate people and remind them to turn off the lights when leaving the place. Methods of rationalizing the consumption of water equipment. Dishwashing. Machines that wash dishes can be used instead of washing them by hand, as these machines are very water saving. Make repairs. Old and damaged plumbing can cause large amount of water to leak, and therefore these must be repaired regularly. Use modern irrigation system. Be sure to use smart irrigation systems to control watering times, which are turned off on rainy days. Leak detection. Leak detection and repair is done by checking faucets, hoses, and toilets, detecting leaks frequently from time to time, and repair them if they are overflowing with water. Methods of rationalizing water consumption in agriculture. 
Fertilizer quality. Choosing the right compost improves soil structure, thus helping it to retain water and moisture for longer periods, which helps save water. Crop quality. Make sure to plant drought tolerant crops that grow in surrounding environment to tolerate drought in terms of saving water. The most prominent of these crops are olives, cucumbers, and pears. Drip irrigation. The drip irrigation process delivers water directly to the roots of the plants, thus helping to reduce water evaporation. Drip irrigation provides approximately 80% of the water used in conventional irrigation. Watering time. Water the garden in the summer once every three days and once every five days in the winter. Be sure to plant the plants in the spring and fall when watering requirements are lower. Methods for rationalizing water consumption and recycling. Rainwater. The process of benefiting from rainwater is by installing a system to collect rainwater in large tanks and then using this water in the garden. Vegetables and fruits waste. Recycling the waste of vegetables and fruits in the form of compost instead of disposing them, which increases the period of water retention within the soil. Water reuse. Using recycled water to irrigate crops. If the air conditioning capacity is more than 100 tons, it is preferable to reuse the water of the air conditioner for irrigation purposes or siphons. For large homes, grey water can be reused, provided that the treated water conforms to the standards of the World Health Organization. For use in irrigation purposes, refueling tanks or any other inhuman uses. Making sure to provide two separate supply networks and two drainage systems with another backup source in the event that the treated water source stops as a result of any technical defect or maintenance. In cleaning, it is preferable to reuse the rejected water from desalination devices for the purpose of cleaning floors.